Hey Tumblr, it's the Imprisoned Philosopher here. I got a request to do a reading of a prose piece that got featured not that long ago called Bella Nina by Lily at liliesofthefield.tumblr.com. So here it is, it's Bella Nina. A young man once got lost in a hospital while visiting his sister. He wandered aimlessly for half an hour or so, till he accidentally came upon a young Hispanic girl crying. He walked over to her, knelt down in front of her so they were eye level, and asked her what was wrong. Instead of responding, she just started crying harder. The man saw a guitar over in the corner of the room, so he went and grabbed it, then returned to the little girl. Shh my bella nina. It will all be okay. Would you like me to play a song for you? The girl, sniffling and wiping away tears, nodded. So he started playing. The song he played, an old Spanish lullaby, started off softly, bordering on sad. But as it progressed, it built into a strong, steady tune. By the time he finished the song, the girl had stopped crying. Now, my bella nina, can you tell me what is wrong? I have cancer, and I'm supposed to get more of my treatment, but I'm so tired of it. It hurts, and they stick lots of needles in me. They make all my hair fall out. I don't want to take more medicine. As soon as the confession poured out of her, tears started leaking from her eyes once more. Hey, it's all right, my bella nina. It's all right. Can I ask you a question? To which she responded with a slight nod. Do you think I'm good at guitar? She just nodded. Do you want to know how I got good at guitar? Again, a nod. It was by playing over and over again. Sometimes I'd play so long my fingers would bleed, but I didn't mind the pain because I know the truth about pain. Would you like me to tell you the truth? Would you like me to share it with you? Once more a nod. This time her eyes were clear of tears. Instead a small gleam of hope had replaced them. Pain is just like money. It's the price we pay to achieve our goals. All things come with a price, but we have to remember that pain, that price makes us stronger. More beautiful people. Do you want to be stronger? Do you want to be even more beautiful than you are now, my bella nina? Yeah, I guess, but I'm just so tired of hurting. I know you are, but I promise it will get better someday. You'll grow up and you'll meet the man of your dreams. You'll have a career you love. Someday you may even raise, raise children of your own and experience the wonder of showing them the world. But if you want to get there, you have to take your medicine. Can you be strong, my bella nina? Can you be strong for me and all the people who care about you? Yes, I can be strong. I'm ready to take my medicine now. With that, she hugged the man and ran off to the nearest nurse. They started walking away, leaving the man to return to his search for his sister. Twenty some odd years passed, and the man often thought about what happened to his bella nina. Then one day he was sitting on a park, sitting in a park near the hospital where he had met the little girl. When a young doctor walked up to him and sat down next to him on the bench, "Hi," she said. "Just want to say thank you." The man was obviously confused. He didn't know this lady. "What are you thankful for?" "I'm thankful for Spanish lullabies played on guitar, on the kindness of a stranger." and words of inspiration that saved my life. I'm grateful for the life I've led, the man of the dreams I married last March, and the growing child within me. In other words, I'm grateful for you. I'm grateful for being your Bella Nina. So that was Bella Nina. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Thank you for listening.